Creating hyper-realistic UGC content with AI avatars is now easy. Here are some examples. You're not looking at a real person, but I can smile, blink, talk, even express emotion, all thanks to a few powerful AI tools. Create a digital version of yourself that looks and talks like this. Let me show you how fit it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. To create a hyper-realistic talking AI avatar, you'll first need a high-quality image. This image is the foundation, and the better it looks, the more realistic your avatar will be. You can use some free image generation tools like Leonardo which is great for photo realistic portraits. Use photo real presets and adjust facial symmetry. Another free tool I love is Google Image FX. However, in this tutorial, I will be using Sora. First, let's head over to Sora and type in your prompt. For paid options, I highly recommend Midjourney. It's fantastic for artistic and lifelike images, but requires prompt skill. When generating your image, here are some do's and don'ts to keep in mind for the perfect avatar. Use neutral lighting and front-facing images. Go for a high-resolution output and keep the facial expression subtle. A light smile works best and make sure your image looks realistic. To achieve this, try adding freckles to your image prompt or keywords like minimal makeup. This will make the avatar look more realistic and human-like. AI has a tendency to produce extremely perfect and flawless skin. No human is so flawless. Some of the don'ts to keep in mind are to avoid the use of artistic filters or exaggerated features. Also make sure you don't crop the head or cut off the forehead. Avoid busy backgrounds. Simplicity keeps the focus on the face. Now it's time to bring your image to life. Hagen is our go-to. The reason I prefer Hagen is the hyper-realistic talking avatars. It also gives us the option to create a custom voice cloning or use one of their built-in natural voices. Hagen also gives the most natural gestures, blinking, lip sync, all in a few clicks. When in Hagen, you can create your avatar in various ways. One of them is the photo to video. Simply upload your photo. Right here, you get the option to either upload an already recorded audio or paste a script. You also get the option to choose a custom motion of how you want your avatar to move, then generate your video. You're not looking at a real person, but I can smile, blink, talk, even express emotion, all thanks to a few powerful AI tools. Second method is to create an avatar. Head over to create your avatar. With this option, you will upload a video of yourself to get a clone version. The duration of your video should be at least 30 seconds to 10 minutes long. Click to upload your video. You will have to agree the, the terms listed here before proceeding. Once your video is done, you get this message. Your avatar look is being created and will be ready in just a few minutes. We will notify you by email when it is ready. Click done and you're directed to this page to name your avatar. You also have to consent again that you are indeed over 18 years of age. The third method is to use the avatars already available on the website. Head over to Quick Avatar Video and choose from their list of avatars. You get the same avatar in different clothes, camera angels, locations and sitting postures. And once again, you are able to upload your audio or paste a script. If you find this video helpful so far, give us a big thumbs up. Other avatar generation tools to check out are Synthesia. I would say this is ideal for business style avatars, clean and professional. Another one I really like is DID. It's great for expressive avatars from simple selfies. I love the fact that you can use cartoon or non-human images. Hagen rejects non-human images. Another honorable mention is Higgs Field. It's more experimental but very dynamic facial motion. An honorable mention is Veo3. The downside to VO3 is the videos are very short, only 8 seconds long, and it's very pricey. Wasn't that easy? Imagine the content you could create now. Tutorials, customer service, storytelling, even influencer marketing. All without stepping in front of a camera. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. And let us know in the comments what kind of AI content you want us to cover next.